Welcome everyone to Ebony Throne Time with Viri from Server 360. Today's topic will be placing a duty general in the new bunker from the upgrade that Ebony had last week. I will also show you the difference in the requirements of the general for the bunker and the other buildings that you've already placed duty generals in. Let's jump right into that. On a normal building, could be embassy, warehouse, trap, any, any, anything up here, anything up here that you've placed the general, uh, all of them, every single one of them have required you to have a cultivating uh, defense or attack or leadership or something at a minimum number. Okay, this is no difference. Um, special embassy officer requires 1,200 defense, 1,150 attack on your general, but it also requires a minimum power level of 3.1 million. The difference between that and the new bunker is you are not required to have a minimum powered general, which is huge. You can place any of your generals that have been cultivated with a defense of 1250 and an attack of 1200. That makes it kind of nice because a lot of us have generals that are just sitting there doing nothing. And we may not use them in PvP or bosses or relics or anything else. So let's assign one of those that I don't use now. And that would be Minamoto. Don't scoff at me. Minamoto has been a good trooper uh, in his time, but I don't use him any longer. So let's appoint him. And look at that, Special Bunker Officer. He is going to give me an additional 100,000 troops that I can put into the bunker along with my 200,000 from the level that I'm at, which is a K28, I believe, or excuse me, uh, yeah, level 28, uh, level 28 for this specific building. Um, so the 200,000 plus 100,000 gives me a total of 300,000. Now I have to tell you, I'm not I'm a little mixed on what the bunker is going to be really useful for. If Avani came out with the bunker and placed higher limits, uh, maybe a, a, a half a march or a full march for me to place in there, um, that would definitely help. But having such low numbers, I really don't see an advantage yet. And maybe we will in the next several weeks with other players out there. But from my side, I just don't see any advantage. So it just uh, it's going to depend on how, if you want to increase this bunker level uh, as high as you can or not based off your play style. Um, so anyways, that will do it for me. Uh, if you like this video, found it informative, please hit my like button. If you want to send me a message, please do so in the comments below or send me a private email at viribus007 at gmail.com. That's V-I-R-I-B as in boy, U-S, 007 at gmail.com. And if you like any of the videos or want to subscribe, please hit this button down here. Until next time, live life first, play Ebony second, and I'll see you on the battlefield.